To track workouts in the Ford Wellness app, click the green plus sign in the lower right corner of your dash screen. There are many things that you can track using the Ford Wellness app, but today we're going to focus on physical activity. Click on the green activity button. There are lots of general physical activities to choose from here. Scroll through to get some ideas of what you can track for your daily physical activity. There's definitely something here for everyone. Today, I'm going to choose hiking. Click the Start Now button. We'll start in three, two, one. Once you're done, click the Stop button and click End Activity. Next, you can enter stats like time, distance, or calories burned, depending on the type of activity you chose. Here, I'm entering the time I took hiking. After saving your stats, you'll receive a motivational message. And when you click the X in the top left corner, you'll see confirmation that your workout was tracked. You can even leave a comment by clicking the comment bubble in the top right corner. Both you and your coach will see the comment, so it's a great way to communicate about your progress and your workouts. Once you X out of this screen, you'll be taken back to your dashboard where you'll see the workout you just did. Now, if you'd like to get more specific about your workouts, you can do that too. Go back to the green plus sign and this time select workout, then select Build WOD or workout of the day. You can choose between regular, circuit, or interval workouts. I'm going to show you how to track a regular workout. Next, click Insert Exercise. This will take you to our database of exercises. There are hundreds of them, and they're all listed in alphabetical order. You can either scroll through and select the exercise based on what you see, or if you already know what you'd like to do, you can type the exercise in the search bar. If you're not sure how to do an exercise that you see, click on the photo to see a description and video that walks you through how to perform the exercise properly. Today, I'm going to select the arc trainer and band bicep curls, but you can select as many exercises as you want to build your workout. Once you've selected your workouts, click Done to continue. Now we have to set targets for each exercise. Targets can be a number of reps, a period of time, or some other goal that you'd like to challenge yourself to achieve. For the arc trainer, I'm going to set a time target of 20 minutes, and for bicep curls, I'm going to set a rep target of 15. The app defaults to three sets for most exercises, but I'm going to change mine to four for more of a challenge. Now I'm going to click Save so that the app saves my workout and targets. You can save this workout for later today or do it now. When you're ready to start your workout, go to your dash, click on Workout of the Day, then Start Now. Enter your stats for each exercise, including for each set, and then save your work. Instead of waiting till your workout is over, it's a best practice to track this during your workout after each set so that you don't forget. Rate your workout on how easy or difficult it was for you, then click Done. Don't forget to leave a note if there's something you want to remember about this workout or if there's something you want your coach to know about your experience. And that's how to track both general and specific workouts. I look forward to seeing your completed workouts.